There is no clash of civilizations. There is a clinically dead civilization kept alive by all sorts of life support machines that spread a peculiar plague into the planet's atmosphere. At this point, it can no longer believe in a single one of its own values, and any affirmation of them is considered an impudent act, a provocation that should and must be taken apart, deconstructed, and returned to a state of doubt. Today, Western imperialism is the imperialism of relativism, of the it-all-depends-on-your-point-of-view. It's the eye-rolling or the wounded indignation at anyone who's stupid, primitive, and presumptuous enough to still believe in something, to affirm anything at all. You can see the dogmatism and constant questioning give its complicit wink of the eye everywhere in the universities and among the literary intelligentsias. No critique is too radical among post-modernist thinkers, as long as it maintains this total absence of certitude. A century ago, scandal was identified with any particularly unruly and raucous negation, while today it's found in any affirmation that fails to tremble.